Okay, today we'll be opening up this used Royal Purple cartridge oil filter, number 20-967. And I got this oil filter from a viewer whose name is John Parada from Yonkers, New York. Thanks, John. This oil filter was in service for one year, 2,500 miles, and came off of John's mother's 2016 Toyota Camry. Yep, the one with the four-cylinder, 2.5-liter engine. Similar to the one pictured in this video. And John's mother was using Mobile One Advanced Fuel Economy 0W20 oil during this period. Let's open up this Royal Purple oil filter and see how it did. So let's get started. This is the network. You got a Louisville silicone. Be nice and tight. Get your end of here. Filtration. Okay, so before we cut this cartridge filter open, Let's take a quick look at it. Right here we got a date code of 042621 EE1. Product of USA. And this cartridge oil filter has metal end caps. A seam right here. And I counted 35 pleats. This has a micron rating of 99% for particles as small as 25 microns. And this filter media is a 100% synthetic micro glass filter media. This filter has a metal, metal inner core with holes. And let's take a weight. I, I opened up one of these before, um, a, a new one. This one obviously has some oil in it, so it's going to be a little more. But the new one was 90 grams. Let's see what this one is. 109.4 grams so it's about 19.4 grams more let's get the width two inches even okay so let's cut this filter midi open squeeze it out stretch it out and see what it looks like and I, I want to mention this also it looks like it has a screen backing to it So, I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the filter all stretched out. And this filter is 33 and 3 quarter inches long. Okay, let's get the thickness of this filter media. 0.56 millimeters thick and it's pretty soft stuff it almost feels like a cloth it's a dual layer Let's see the back side front side you can actually tell there's there's two layers to this you can have a part there you go And let's take a look at this under a microscope. And as you can tell by the microscope pick, the front side, the filtering side here is pretty dirty, but the back side is pretty clean. You can actually see the little, I guess they're micro glass fibers in there. So I threw the uh, back pick of it in there also. I thought it was pretty cool looking. And let's take a look at this up close. So there really isn't any soot that, you know, whatever's in there is right into the filter itself. Any dirt. And I don't really see any sparklies. This filter material, it feels like a cloth. Or actually even, you know, like maybe like a wet toilet paper. <laughs> it's very soft. So this filter went through 2,500 miles, so that's not too bad. But um, the filter did its job, I would say. Looks like there's something right there, but I don't, maybe not. Let's look at the rest of the filter. So the filter's got this metal screen backing. You can see it all here. 
And it holds its shape when you bend it. And you just got this metal core. This is almost like a regular kind of filter. I'm surprised most of them are made out of plastic. But this is well built, that's for sure. So what do you guys think about this filter? And again, I want to thank John for sending me this oil filter. And I think I'll wrap this video up. And don't forget, Oil Filter Fridays. I open up an oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching and take care.